In Terminator 1, ter the Terminator had the shot. And we came to the conclusion that the Terminator does require some processing time to process faces and situations. And I think here we can actually get a time scale on this. Let's watch. That's so quick. from head, it's quick, but it's also from head turn to t ident, ident positive. It's like a good second. Yeah. It's so I guess quick, but not that quick. Not that quick. I mean, a human can turn their head, look at a person and identify them within a second if they're familiar with them. So, yeah, for sure. So I think this is evidence that the robots do require processing time. They're not just like quick, 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 quick all the time, like uh, microsecond sort of stuff. Um, and this is this is in daytime, sunny day, so the face is well lit. Where was the old place? The old place was, was like in a club. It was dim, lots of noise, lots of people. Mm -hmm. So just like humans, when there's like extra sensory stuff going on, then mm -hmm. your processing speed is slower. Right. And I, and I think that makes sense. I think it's still slower. Like it's still slower than when he was processing Sarah Connor, deciding whether he should kill her or not. And I think that is reasonable because because the machine the machines were were made from skynet and skynet was made as a human like like a, a threat to turn or i guess it was, it was military mm -hmm. asset where they could they could assess their their mm -hmm. targets and then decide for themselves and so just like humans i imagine i imagine like humans would have baked into skynet like multiple layers of approval mm -hmm. before you say okay pull the trigger so finding john connor to save him like it doesn't require those layers of like, do I need to check this before I kill it? Uh, right. He can acquire John Connor very quickly. Very quickly. Cool. I mean, I, I, yeah. buy it. I, I guess I was also thinking that John acquiring John Connor in a one second mm -hmm. is actually fairly slow for a robot. Not quick. That's what I was thinking. I see. So I guess what would it need to do? It would need to, a robot would need to see John Connor and then pull up its files and like compare it. I guess compare the face and that could be real quick and so could it's be. taking longer than than what we would think like a computer would take right but i guess what it's he's the terminator is processing john connor's face at a pretty decent distance and with you know hit the hairs in john connor's face the lighting could be all funky changing and angles changing and angles you know and the the file he may have is just straight on versus at the side like he has to do some 3d rotation so there's lots of thinking going on Lot, lots of thinking going on which adds up to maybe a second and so. it's not 100 percent confident 99.45 percent probability oh okay. i like it all right because mm, right you don't you don't guarantee identify someone you're like eh, it's pretty good that's right yeah hmm. very cool. Ident positive excellent Ident yeah excellent t101 good 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 minor abbreviation <laughs> I mean, it cuts down on, on processing time, right? Yeah. Like a shorter string. I identity. Ident I identity. Okay, I'm not going to spell it right now. Yeah, hey, don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs>